I have the privilege to be here with Ian Anderson, who's chairman of BADA, and Phil Hansen, who is operations and marketing director. Uh, and congratulations, well, congratulations to actually to both of you, because BADA has actually won two awards in the Inside Hi-Fi Home Cinema magazine just two days ago. Um, you for the outstanding contribution to the industry, and I'd like to talk to you about that, and, and Phil for the training courses and participation with uh, a couple other firms in, in this in this thing. So this is this is great. Why don't we start with you? I, what you know, over the last year when we, when we talked about BADA, it seems like there's a it's a real acceleration of interest, um, and and the fact that you won the outstanding contribution to the industry means that. That people are, are listening, obviously listening to you. So maybe you can give our readers and our viewers a little bit of insight what Bada has been up to over the last year that's created this buzz and where we're where we going from here. Sounds like we got a good year in front of us here. Well, Bob, thanks very much for the opportunity. I think really the, um, the last year's acceleration has been uh, manifest because of the two and three years that we've uh, we've had where we've put some really hard work into our training courses and the direction those training courses are moving okay. in. Okay. Every manufacturer in this industry have, have their own training courses for their own products. And the key to the success of Barda's Demcraft and why we've got the award for that, and the key to the achievement, I suppose, for the award that I've got, mm. is that we've put a lot of hard work into trying to find out what the generic situation is with regard to courses so that we could strip out things that are generic that apply to every manufacturer. And we can put that together in a course so that we can take a basic course for hi-fi, a basic course for vision, and we can uh, put that course together for all of our members and people outside the uh, uh, BARDA membership. It doesn't have to be BARDA members for DemCraft and VisionCraft. And we can teach these people the generics before they go to their specific manufacturer's courses. And uh, they've just given that recognition because... It's been a long haul, but we're finally there. Okay. Bill, what would you like to, maybe you can pick up the ball on that from Ian and, and talk a little bit about, and more, a little more in detail, where these training courses will be going over the next year then. Of course. Thank you, Bob, for the opportunity yeah. to talk about yeah. this. Uh, we launched Demcraft about two years ago, and we have put a substantial number of barter dealers through the course and some non-barter dealers. We're now moving forward to the next stage of development for Demcraft, where we've gained the support of... Um, between 15 and 20 of the top manufacturers of audio equipment to enable us to push the courses to all barter dealers and the intention being to get every single customer facing member of staff in every single barter shop trained to Demcraft standards. Okay. And on top of that we're also going to get the manufacturers sales representatives trained to the same standard. So, so we're moving the whole we're moving the whole industry whole up. up. Okay. We have a level playing field from which everybody can start to build for the future to make the industry more able to cope with the changes in technology that are coming. Yeah, we've had a, we've had a couple of times. We had a call, I had a talk in the U.S. with uh, Tony Germani and saying, you know, the industry is really going to change, and if people don't learn quickly that they have to cope with all the technology, it's not the same as doing an installation 10 years ago. It's not the same. The city of celebrated its 17th anniversary. You're celebrating your 25th. 25th. Yeah. Yes. You've seen a lot of changes in this industry, and it's becoming much more technical. And if you don't do it right, maybe what would you like? Could I, could I just make, make um, one comment on that? Over yeah. the 25 years, barter standards haven't actually changed. We, we, we've had good standards, and we select our members by the criteria um, that we've always selected them. They have to have demonstration uh, rooms. They have to have good trained quality staff. But this is going to revolutionize what barter does. <laughs> We're going to increase our standards on the basis of this. Once we get 100% staff through on Demcraft, yep. then the requirements go up. And it's going to carry on, as you say, Bob. This industry it's, it's is... very. Te it's getting it to be very techy. To, to, to Indeed. The multi-room system is not, it's not, a, it's not a slam dunk. You know, it's not just Absolutely. A twist and do it with a, with, a, with a screwdriver anymore. You've got to be pretty competent about doing a lot of different things now. Well, we're working with CDA as well so that we can uh, dovetail our courses into CDA and ISF because we've got connections with CDA and ISF and we're talking to both of them so that yeah. the future so, courses... Uh, we're there too, so we're Brilliant. all a bit, one big happy That's family. Exactly. That's Indeed. great. Indeed. And congratulations again. It's been a pleasure. Thank you very much. We'll be following you a little closer this year. Bill, it's been a pleasure again to see you. Thank you, Bob. Good to see you. Uh, and uh, again, as the courses roll out and the, and the planning gets definitive, you'll be giving us that information for our viewers that want to attend the courses. We'll, we'll be telling them when they are and where they are and, and uh, 
and how to get there, basically. Yeah. Yeah. Thanks very much for your interest. It's been a pleasure. Thank, thank, you. thank you very much. Thank, thank you. you. Thank you both.